In 2007, Subaru introduced the world's first diesel boxer engine, the EE20. Over the years, this engine has gone through various upgrades to meet tighter emission standards, which results in three different injector types being used. This edition of Tech Tips proudly brought to you by the Our Auto Series 3 Premium Diagnostic Tool, the essential motor tech companion. When working with high pressure pumps and injectors, it's crucial to know the type of system you're dealing with. Subaru's EE20 engine uses a Denso common rail diesel system originally fitted with G2 injectors designed to meet Euro 4 regulations. From 2009, G3 injectors were introduced offering higher pressure and faster performance to comply with Euro 5 standards. While G2 and G3 injectors are both actuated by solenoids and look identical, the G3 variants have more correction points. It's important to be aware of these differences, especially when swapping engines or components between vehicles of different emission standards. From 2015 onwards, the EE20 received a major redesign to comply with Euro 6 standards. Piezo injectors were introduced alongside changes to cylinder heads and timing chain layout. However, the engine still retains the EE20 designation. Like many common rail diesel engines, the EE20 is susceptible to fuel contamination, which can damage the high pressure pump and injectors. If contamination occurs, it is essential to replace all affected components and thoroughly flush the entire fuel system to prevent future failures. For detailed procedures for both these jobs, or for more information on the Subaru EE20 engine, see the November 2024 issue of VACC's Tech Talk magazine. Log on to VACC Motor Tech or call VACC's Tech Advisory Service.